In recent years, loader malware has emerged as a significant concern for organizations worldwide, given its widespread availability within the malware-as-a-service marketplace. One notable example is Smoke Loader, which first appeared in the wild in 2011 and has been observed targeting the network of various organizations, including a Dark Trace customer in Latin America. Smoke Loader is notorious for its ability to evade traditional security measures by frequently changing its C2 infrastructure. It infects compromised devices with additional malicious payloads, ranging from password stealers and banking trojans to cryptocurrency mining malware and ransomware. Darktrace Network detected a device within the customer's environment engaging in suspicious behavior, including unusual connections to suspicious endpoints and DNS requests for previously unseen domains. The same device was later observed downloading multiple executable files from endpoints associated with known malware, as well as connecting to several endpoints linked with Smoke Loader. Additionally, Darktrace uncovered activity indicating possible crypto mining malware infection, evidenced by connections to the cryptocurrency mining pool Minergate. Darktrace's cyber AI analyst autonomously investigated these events, relating seemingly isolated connections into a broader C2 incident. This provided the customer with comprehensive visibility over the suspicious activity. Moreover, as the customer was subscribed to Darktrace's proactive threat notification service, the detected activity was promptly escalated to Darktrace's round-the-clock SOC team for immediate triage and investigation. Following the investigation, the customer received a notification detailing the activity and advising on follow-up actions. As this threat demonstrates, Darktrace can effectively detect and mitigate the evasive and versatile smoke loader malware. Our anomaly-based approach enables the swift detection of malicious connections and download attempts successfully countering the ever-changing C2 infrastructure employed by the attackers.